Okay boys, welcome back to the new video. Today we are doing career of Ethan Mbappé. As you can see on this comment, Precious Squad make me great idea and yeah, here we are and let's start with this career. As you can see, we submitted loan request uh, because basically we can't get any playtime with 72 overall rated and there is of course Kylian Mbappé, Neymar, Messi and a lot of better players here in Paris Saint-Germain. So yeah, let's wait for offer from another low league club. Unfortunately, it's 1st September of 2022 and as you can see we're still in PSG so we received some small loan offers but I think the clubs uh, were not good for us so I guess we'll stay in Paris Saint-Germain for first season. Believe me or not, we received offer from uh, Real Madrid for transfer but uh, we simply rejected that uh, because I mean it's same situation as in PSG so yeah we couldn't get any play time in Real Madrid also. Okay boys it's uh, January of 2023 and as you can see we got an loan offer and I think it's the right time to move and possibly help this club uh, to their promotion and their glory. Okay, I just recognized this is a Saudi Arabian club, I think, and they don't have second league and it's just one league and no promotions, no relegations, but hey, here we are and let's make a great performance here in the Saudi Arabia. We are starting at 74 rated on striker and I think we are what this team need exactly. So yeah, let's see in the half of the season and see how we do in Saudi Arabia. Season is over, we finished the third. It's Al Halil, one place above us, but yeah, it's okay. I mean, it's Saudi Arabian division and there is Asia Continental Cup and I think we are not there. Yes, we aren't. And it's European Championship qualifiers also. Let's see how our player did it this season. Okay, we are definitely the best score in our team with 21 goals in just a couple of games. And I mean, we are up by two overall just in half of a season and boys not gonna lie this sounds promising but even though this sounds promising we are returning to our club in just couple days so I mean will Pochettino play us in the next season we'll see okay officially we are back in Paris Saint Germain and as you can see by news we won golden boot of Saudi American division and here we are back in PSG we are starting as 76 overall rated 17 year old striker Ethan Mbappé playing with our brother Kylian Mbappé in same squad and oh my god Kylian is already 75 rated and guys please imagine Ethan Mbappé and Kylian Mbappé playing in same squad and winning Champions League against enemies I mean that sounds like a dream but I think we are not on that level right now and yeah basically as you can see I will do training I mean every one or two week and simply simulate through the season as you can see in calendar and yeah I'll give you report guys uh, when the season is over Despite all of our efforts to stay for this season, Pochettino is rushing us to go away and here we go, we are in the same league just playing for Lille. Okay, we are starting in Lille as 76 rated like we did in Paris Saint-Germain and there is also good players like Nino, like Fer Nino on striker and uh, I mean he is like 78 overall rated so we are second striker right now, yes. But I think through the season we will be Lille's uh, first striker with uh, no issue. Okay, this is how our squad looks like in Lille and the coach decided to play 4-4-2 formation with us and Nino in strikers. So yeah, let's simulate through the season with this club. We also have a decent defenders right here and I think our team is really balanced. Okay, it's end of the season, it's June as you can see and 
we are injured it's a match fit in two days and let's see where we finished we are 15 league and league one of course a Paris Saint-Germain with 85 points let's see Coupe Nationale it's also Paris Saint-Germain I mean this team is broken in FIFA 22 and oh my god Champions League won Chelsea against Bayern Munich Europa League won Inter and let's see Conference League it's Real Sociedad against the Wolves okay also our stats in the end of this season is uh, okay I mean looking that we had the injury for the most of the season and we are still injured we score 15 games in 13 matches played and I mean as you can see our form is still okay and Oh my god, why did we get this injury? I mean, we could be the best player in the league if we hadn't, hopefully. Okay, as you can see, our status is submitted the transfer request, but we didn't. Our coach don't want us in squad anymore, and that's kind of uh, disrespect to us, and we shall move on because of that, and why coach don't believe in us anymore anyway it's a new season new beginning let's see where we move to it's been a wild transfer window we see a lot of offers as you can see but we want to give a try at Wolfsburg 35k per week and Ethan Mbappe is going to Wolfsburg Okay, season in Wolfsburg is over, we are in top 3, okay, we are in top 2, did we win the league? Yes, we won the league with 4 points more than Borussia Dortmund, to be specific, 71 points and 22 wins this season, I mean amazing performance, let's see Pokal Cup and Pokal Cup is playing like 2 unknown clubs uh, this year, let's see UEFA Champions League, Okay, it's Real Madrid and Paris Saint-Germain, our former club is playing final and uh, we want them luck. Uh, Leicester and Milan are playing Europa League final. We got kicked out by Ghent on penalties, oh my god. And uh, fortunately we are best scorer in our team. In 45 appearances we have around 40 goals and 3 assists. Our rating went up by 5 and we are now 83 rated striker and I mean we are only 19 years of age. We have a promising future right here. As you can see our brother Kylian Mbappe won a Champions League and yeah that's good to know that's good to know and congratulations okay it's a december as you can see and player of the year is announced it's our brother Kylian mbappe and as you guys know and the player follow fifa fifa is somehow favorizing this player to win ballon d'or every year or every two year i think season is over as you can see it's june 30th of 2026 and we are injured for 70 days Despite the injury, we made a great performance this season as well. In 42 matches, we scored 30 goals and we made 5 assists. I think this Ethan Mbappé will be better than his brother at some point. So yeah, let's continue with the series and continue with the new season. Okay, we are back from injury. We are still rated 87, as you can see at only 20 years of age and our manager submitted transfer list once again i'm not sure what's going on with this manager and why they have trust issues man it's just not okay to me to leave club after just one season and i think we need to settle it's a new season a new beginning a new chance to prove ourselves on the pitch and yeah basically transfer window is over nobody wanted us so yeah we'll try to prove ourselves here in Wolfsburg for one more season and prove the coach that we are men he still want in this squad okay season in German is over we finished the fifth and league won Hertha Berlin with 78 points and as you remember last season we won the Bundesliga we are grouped we finished third and we are in Europa League okay Benfica won against us in out of 16 oh my god what a disappointing move from Wolfsburg 
and our stats that we got only two appearances this season and our overall went up by two and it's just a shame for coach to leave us out of the game I mean we are good player we play well we have good performance and we and most importantly we score goals and we create chance on the pitch I mean where are we doing wrong here guys believe it or not it's 9th august of 2027 and we got offer from real madrid and i mean if kylian mbappe don't want to go to real madrid ethan will and ethan is all about passion and not about money and here we are our coach is carlo ancelotti and we are ruling number 10 this season Real Madrid looks promising, they have Ethan Mbappe, they have Osimhen, they also have Mares, but I think he is a little bit old right now and they have Vinicius Jr and I mean Vinicius is like 91 right now, yes I think they also got Courtois right here and Courtois is like 90 overall I think, yes, they still keep Isco and I mean, Real Madrid squad looks fantastic for the upcoming season. Season is over, we finished the first, let's see who in Supercopa, it's Barcelona and we got kicked out by Atletico Madrid, Copa de España won Barcelona in El Clasico against us, why, why did we lose that? Champions League final play Milan and Manchester United we lost to Piemonte Calcio in quarterfinals. I mean, really embarrassing move for Real Madrid. Europa League is playing between Chelsea and Tottenham Hotspur and every time I play FIFA there is like a big teams uh, playing final in Europa League. Let's check our stats. We scored the 42 goals in 37 appearances with 5 assists and we are 91 overall rated right now I mean we are top score in our team with just 37 appearances and I guess we got injured in the middle of the season but yeah there is also Vinicius Jr with 19 goals also was here with 15 goals this season I mean I'm not lying when I say Real Madrid squad is uh, looking ridiculously, ridiculously good I mean. Of course we stood at Real Madrid and we finished second in the league and let's check the Supercopa, Supercopa won Atletico Madrid against Real Sociedad, Copa de España won Real Valladolid, I mean what's going on, let's check UEFA Supercopa, it's Milan. Champions League, we are playing Champions League against uh, Milan and let's get uh, right into the game and finally possibly win the first trophy with uh, Ethan Mbappe in Champions League. Okay, this is how our squad looks like, we are playing as center forward and uh, I'm not sure where is uh, Benzema in the team so far. Kuto is on goal, on our center backs is Torres Saliba, there is Miranda, also Kamavinga, right is Bernardo Silva, left is Ferrand, I'm not sure why Ferrand is starting over Vinicius Jr, but okay, let's get right into the game against Milan. Okay, here we are in the game and as you already follow my account on YouTube, you already know we are playing Legendary Difficult and let's see, can we make a positive impact here, we have chance, our shoot is blocked, can we score again? Okay, it's Kamawinga, it's 1-0 in 5th minute of the game, Real Madrid is leading against the Milan in Champions League, I mean Kamawinga is captain for reason. 1-0 Kamawinga Okay, here is counter attack and we are looking for ball Ball is lost, it's a Gomez Milan will try to make a counter attack right here as well Fratesi sending ball to Rafael Liao Liao is getting inside the box and lower right corner Courtois was just unbelievably bad in this situation, I mean it could go with save, man, I really think it could go with save, but okay, it's 1-1, one, one. let's calm down and continue with game. And we are having a solo run right here, we are inside corner, we are shooting, and what a save from Milan's goalkeeper, I mean, 
that's beautiful save it's a cross we are trying we it's header and uh, it's a goal kick for milan okay milan is going with attack right here it's osim Hien who went from real madrid to milan in last transfer window it's osim Hien right now sending ball to rafael liao liao is looking for options nice dribbles it's all this all this it's inside the box so this is passing to fratelli and nothing it's tonali to suffer mafkers and it's goal again mistake from our defenders i mean our defenders look sloppy i'm not sure why are they bad is it pressure or something else but let's see can we equalize this game okay it's a second half and we are having counter attack right here ethan mbappe is getting inside the box amazing left foot shoot and it's equalizer 2-2 real madrid milan in a late game okay we are in extra time and of course guys leave a comment and wish me luck okay mbappe ethan is going wide he's looking for cross he's crossing and goalkeeper is boxing that he's getting in position to shoot difficult position shooting and oh my god what a goal for leading in champions league final and of course there is a celebration we are leading against uh, AC Milan in the late game, to be specific, in extra time. I mean, look at the replay, amazing goal. It's finally full time, 3-2 for Real Madrid in a Champions League final and it's first Ethan Mbappé's trophy in a Champions League and here we are. Okay, here is our captain Kamawinga. 3, 2, 1, and Real Madrid is the champions once again. Right now with captain of Kamavinga. To be honest, Kamavinga was incredible today with that goal. And I mean, he started everything. And guys, we came to the end of this episode. And of course, if you enjoyed, leave a subscribe and click on that like button. Also, leave a comment which player you want to see next because I saw you enjoyed and supported the Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. career mode. Till the next episode, see ya!